Whoa, try, don't die. All right, everybody, welcome back. All right, I did it. Sam did it. He finally made it after so many dives into the lava. And I thought this was just going to be um, a, a night, like a power up or what something. What is it? Scan it, it first. It, well, it's definitely a power up. It's just. Oh! Plasma beam! This is the plasma beam! Okay. Plasma beam! So that was the end of that puzzle, and now we have um, the coolest gun in the whole game. Holy shit. It's she's red. Still got, she's got lava in her arm. She's got lava in her arm. It burns Some her skin. Some magma. Some molten hot magma. Well, that was worth it. That was worth it. Uh, it's kind of interesting, right? Like, we kind of didn't need to do that. Like, oh, that seemed kind of optional. It kind of seemed a little optional to me. I'm not really a hundred. Then again, um, it just didn't like tell me immediately. I feel like we did this first. Yeah. Like we could have gotten the X-ray beam first, and like look how cool we look. Shoot it. We look really neat. Whoa. Whoa. Boom. Shit. That's awesome. It's kind of a short range weapon. A little bit. Doesn't seem to go too too far. See how it kind of. Yeah, it's just like a... See how it kind of small fades burst. out? Yeah. I think it hits this pillar. It does. See that pillar? It See that pillar gets it? Man, this game is good at particle effects, but like, check this out. That definitely hits that wall. Yeah. So it's like, this is a much further ranging weapon. So, welcome back. So, should we should we pause now and wait till you get to that, that room you need to go to? All yeah. All the way the fuck back? No. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to pause. We just showed you that we got the plasma beam. I just wanted to show you that, and we got to go over here now, okay? Okay, so we're pausing now. Hey, everybody, sorry for these horrible cuts. Uh, we actually had <laughs> we had uh, our Aver Media let us know we were running out of space, so we had what? to... What? You mean our magic You mean our magic TV? Our magic TV capture device. Yeah, exactly. Welcome back. We got I a got, missile I, expansion. I just got a missile expansion. That you could have gotten at the start of the game. I could have, yeah. I mean... <laughs> Well, technically, you needed the the, the, bombs. the morph ball. Yeah, the morph ball. Well, no, you don't need the. I don't think you need the morph ball bombs. You probably could have done it just like shoot and then. Go. <laughs> oh god, that felt great. It's Welcome like, back. Sounded great. It, it sure did. And now we're gonna go through here. Um, so how far are we from this goddamn life room? A fucking quadrillion years, obviously. <laughs> it's it's like that. Everything in this game. Is so spread out. This is the biggest backtrack the game has made us do so far. I'm pretty sure. This is yeah. This one's a little obnoxious. That it's just like. By the way, um, are we gonna fast fun forward to fact, it? Fun fact. No, we're no. not. Okay. We're gonna do. We're gonna kick this one old school people, and we're gonna go through here. We're gonna get our X-ray visor, and then we're gonna go out. Then we're gonna go back to phase on mines and get us back to where the X-ray visor was. Like, oh my god, you need the X-ray visor. Basically, it's gonna be great. I can't wait to show everybody everything. And then this guy should just die, like, with one hit. Like, I'm pretty sure fire is not his friend. Yeah, so that's really cool that I can just shoot those one dudes. And I can just leave him alone. Damn. Yeah, Damn, and they're son. just done. Even underwater? Mm-hmm. Nice. Oh, didn't get him. He's a little, he's a little sturdier. Come on. Tell me a joke. <laughs> okay, cool. I am jumping up this thing. So, uh, yeah, have you ever um, needed to take two shits in the morning? Uh, One right time. after another? Actually, uh, we're, if we're going to get into get into shit talk. <laughs> <laughs> Straight um, up shit talk. Yeah, like, I, I'm, I'm the kind of person where, like, I have to have my morning coffee, and then my morning coffee just runs through me. Yeah. But then I feel great after. Oh, I feel God. excellent. I don't doubt it, man. Like, I bet morning coffees and, and stuff like that, like, it's a diuretic, right? Yeah. So, it just makes you go, go nuts or rooney with the poops. And I'm just the type of person who, pretty much no matter what, I just gotta go for that double shit in the morning, basically. <laughs> Which, <laughs> that double-double. I gotta go for that double-double. Hi, can I get a double-double? That double-double double 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 down. down. Yeah. I actually like. I, I looked it up, double shit, and then it was it was pretty much just as I, like, thought it was going to be. <laughs> it was like Urban taking, Dictionary says taking a shit like fifteen minutes after like you just take a shit basically. Like you you weren't finished. Like you weren't. It was just like you, my god, dude, you just had that much stool inside of your bowel. <laughs> <laughs> Please like, comment, subscribe for uh, for shit talk. I yeah, I mean, I just wanted to pose that to the audience yeah. and wanted to how see often where you take they, shit. Yeah, how often? <laughs> some people 
you know, they they, they never shit at all. They don't they don't shit that much <laughs> or something. Can't imagine that. Oh crabs! So wouldn't that be just uncomfortable if oh, you yeah. had to wait for like a week before you could shit? I felt like as a kid I did that. Are you serious? I think so. Like that is ridiculous. Cause I, I never wanted to go because I was always too busy like playing a game or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> like I felt like I just like held it in as long as humanly possible. Well then the switch must be like a godsend for Oh you. yeah. Because <laughs> now you can just like play Legend of Zelda for hours. And play and can. poop. It's that play and poop functionality. Yeah. You gotta you gotta play but, all like the poops. The thing is, like I don't know how well my memory serves me, because mm. I feel like I did it to the extent that I didn't poop for years. What? Like, and I know that I know that's impossible. That is impossible. You'd be dead. Yeah. Be physically. But I, I feel like that's how long I did that for. You can talk about other stuff. Yeah, let's talk about games that are out or coming out that we want to play. Because fuck, we're gaming. Oh god. <laughs> yeah. Um. Dragon Ball Fighter Z is on our list. Dragon Ball Fighter Z is. Wanna get I'm it. gonna buy it. Now I'm gonna test this theory. Which didn't do anything. Uh, <laughs> didn't do no, nothing. I guess not. Didn't do shit. Um, but I also want to get the Inpatient. Um, Inpatient? It's a VR game uh, by the oh. people who made Until Dawn. Oh. And it's... Uh, More Until Dawn people? Yeah. Oh my god. It's, I don't know how spoilery this is, so if, if you don't want any spoilers, jump ahead a little bit in this episode. But uh, I hear that it takes place 60 years before Until Dawn. Really? Yeah. 60 years before? Yeah. So it's in the same universe. Same universe. So that's like an IP that they're turning into a franchise. Kind of. That's weird. And cool. But yeah, I wanna And get, expected. I want to get the, the Impatient. It looks neat. Uh, the reviews I'm hearing aren't great in terms of the actual gameplay itself. They mm. say it feels a little bit disjointed. Weird. And I think I think we're not at the point where VR games are exactly hitting their full stride. Their no, full potential. of course not. They so the the things I've seen though, like if you checked out my like like that, it well we act, actually have to do like a VR playthrough at we some do. point, and I think it's gonna be like Resident Evil just on its own, like as a VR experience. I know we're well like anyway we're well, we spoiler might, alert we might be we have, have we might have a little Evil Resident Evil playthrough. On the way. Yeah, yeah. We might have one that Matt and Matt and Mike have started, but um, we want to play through that game because I I love that game. Mike loves it. He loves it dearly. Was it praised heavily? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's great. That that um, oh wow, that's it, so good. It got the recognition it deserved, I think. Yeah, praised that is God. that is good. And like, just I had about two hours. Would you say I had about two hours playing it? You got a, you got a decent amount in. I think. Like and I and I solved you know some of the problems on some my of own. the puzzles some of the some of the puzzles and shit. Um, but and I, I was nerve wracking. I've been playing the DLC actually. Oh uh, god! And the DLC has been fantastic. That is um, so cool. I, I I love it when you just get a good piece of DLC that kind of like complements the game and the story. Yeah. Uh, it just it just feels nice. <laughs> I never played like the Bioshock. Um, oh DLC. my god! I never <laughs> okay. played. Oh god. Dang. We we gotta get back to some Bioshock somehow, some way, because there's the even the DLC. Like I want you and Matt to go through the DLC because mm -hmm. it's so good. Like That's Minerva's great. Den um, DLC for Bioshock Two is really good. That yeah, that's what I mean. That, that, that like, one's that one's critically acclaimed. Oh, that's so cool! Like, and, and um, um, I do remember that that got a lot of praise. But I never it Return to Rapture for Infinite. I gotta actually play through Bioshock Two. Did you beat that one? I did. I did. Whoa, man! Um, and I mean, like it was like I was enjoying. I understand. It. I understand people's gripes with it, but it doesn't deserve the hate it gets. I didn't. I don't. I did not hate it when I played it for for sure. It just I was. I read the it. main complaint from everybody is it's more of the same. And that's why they didn't play or why they didn't finish it. I had about a week rental with it with Blockbuster. With, with the Blockbust. With the Blockbust. Yeah. Before they went bust. Um, hey, you're you're. But yeah, I, I'd say like if you wanted to hop into that game for sure, it's a lot of fun. Oh, that's great! I would love to play that with you guys. Yeah. That is maybe, great. Maybe we'll do that on the. On would the you show? like to play it? Okay, there you yeah. go. Yeah, he's done. He's a. He's a I, I like he's if a we do that. Player. I don't think we'll do that as a as a one try don't die. I think that we'll do that as an on the couch. That way. We don't limit ourselves to when we're ending that one. Mm -hmm. I, I agree with that. Yeah. Because um, I know that game less well. And I bet maybe, per, per chance you do, 
let us, let us know it as well. I actually I played... I think I started the PS4 version of it, mm -hmm. but I didn't finish the PS4 version of it. The PS3 version, I definitely did. 100% definitely did it. That's cool. Um, but yeah, the DLC for Bioshock has been pretty fantastic. That is that is great. I it is it seems like it's definitely worth checking out. I also hope we get I another Bioshock game. I would like that too, but didn't Irrational Studios like didn't they disband or are they still kicking? Um like two I think I think it's something like 2K still owns the IP. They sure do. So if they um, wanted to make a new Bioshock, they could yeah. do it like that. I feel like if anyone's going to try to do it, they're going to go uh, all prey about it and kind of like make it make a new IP ar around it. I mean, like they might possibly they like, might like change. They I, might, I like, think they, they might, might like do like they've had Bioshock Infinite, right? So they've had, they've they might had try their to do trilogy. The, I think so they, they might, might try like, to do space or, as well. Well, it's, one would argue that that's prey, but yeah. like it's not the same developer. It would have to be like an official, but I feel like people just. It's like that spiritual successor thing, basically. Like, you know, it's. Uh, I, I, I'd be interested to see what they're going to do with the franchise. Um, if anything at all. If anything, yeah. Because the last like, thing they were supposed to do was supposed to be a game for the Vita that just never materialized. That is so weird yeah. that a game like that. It was probably going to be a port, to be honest. Man, that's. I. I wonder if. Um, if you can condense that whole experience to a, um, you know, just like that. I think so because the Vita like can the handle Vita. a lot. It can, yeah. I and it's actually, a, it's unfortunate how quickly Sony just kind of dropped its support of it mm -hmm. because that that killed it. Like because the second it wasn't making the second the money. year, yeah, it, it just it wasn't making the money, and the so. 3DS was already doing too well. Oh, yeah, it's so crazy. Um... Apparently, in one of the I can't really vouch for this game, but apparently, like if you take like a face, if you take like a space pirate from Metro Prime Two Echoes, it would its amount of pixels that it used to make that one space pirate would like constitute like multiple multiple like levels and worlds in Metro Prime Hunters. Jeez, because of just how how little it took to like make stuff on that console, basically. I uh, guess. Metro Prime Hunters. I want another one of those too. Hmm. That'd be great. Hopefully they tie some of that stuff into Metroid Prime 4, because that'd be fantastic. Yeah. Okay, get us to this, this other section here. Get us to that, the room. It's we're gonna, almost there. It's, so it's almost there. We're almost there. We're I know there. you're impatient. We're going we're gonna to let this episode run a little bit longer you're so we get to this goddamn room. You're an impatient Andy. Yeah. I, have a, I, have a, I have a plan, okay? I know what I want to do. I'm a cool guy. Um, I went to school. <laughs> My mom really likes me. My mom really likes me, and that... that that to me is everything. So okay, go, do it. Done, ski. And it's it's gonna be crazy, dude, because we totally needed the power bomb to we actually did. get through here. There you go. And oh my god, if you say to me you could have just used a normal bomb, you are mistaken. You are dead wrong, sir or madam. Dead wrong right there. As a boom, as a boom, as a boom. Hey, hey, hey! I don't know what that was. It was not anything. It was the rumble of the controller. <laughs> so are we here? Are we doing it? We're doing a thing. Nice. X-ray yeah, visor. The thing that is so cool. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Now we're getting really upgraded. This is like... Man. I knew when we got this, this is like, we're getting serious now. Because now we have pretty much the coolest visor in the game. What was that? I don't know. Isn't that cool though? Yeah. It's it's kinda like, cool. Get that visor out. Boom. It's a little hard to look at. What do you see? What the hell? Is it just that, open? Isn't that cool? So it just leads outside? It um no. It's it's an x-ray visor. So, so we're just seeing see through, through certain walls. walls, yes. Cool. Can we break through them? Mm, maybe. I feel like we should. Yeah, yeah. We're going to be able to break through this one. Oh. Bendesium. Bendesium Frazier. <laughs> George, George. George of the jungle. Watch out for that. Bendesium rock. Did you like that? I, I did. It was enjoyable. I mean... It's what I thought of in the moment. Boom! There we go. Is there anything else in here for us to grab? 
Probably, but the life grove. Okay. So this is a whole, yeah. Like so we, we haven't in, been. Are here. we in uncharted territory right this now? This is uncharted. We haven't. This is uncharted with Nathan Drake. Is it? Yeah. Okay. So should we should we stop here and continue this on the next episode? Or you yeah, want to I think really so. Fun? I mean, like this is this is probably fine. Yeah. Let's. Oh, okay. Actually, we could uh, you know, we could show this. Yeah. Does that does well, that we're work? We're still recording. We're still doing it. We got some 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 pirate ghosts. Okay, so we're gonna. Ha we're gonna oh. switch to this, and now we're able to. Boom. Okay. Oh, you can see her bones. Now I can. Now I can track them like no tomorrow. Look how fast they go. It's yeah, just nuts. Nice. They're just like, oh, I'm gonna fly everywhere. Boom. 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 Oh god. You can see Samus's bones too when she, she raises her arms. Or no? Well, no. The plasma beam won't work on these guys. No. No. I'll show you. I don't know. Something happening, Mike? Something's happening. Something's happening in, li in Mike's life. Yeah, it's telling you to hurry the fuck up. <laughs> Thank you. It may oh, it makes me feel really good about the situation that we're in, where we record everything that we play. And okay, here we go. Shoot him. I got him. Oh, no. Shoot him, him. This really simplifies this fight. This fight right here. Okay. Now we get this. We did it. We did it. Next time on the show, we'll go down that hole and we'll go back to the face on mines. Alrighty. Isn't that the thing that everyone wants to see? Yep. Goodness. You actually making some progress. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you on the next time. Thank you, everyone.